Hello everyone, welcome to Apex2 and Leaders Power. This is Ada. Today I would like to introduce you an ETH Power ASIC miner called YM100. It is the most powerful with 2400 mAh per second and owning 2300 watt power consumption. We all know Ethereum is the most popular public blockchain in the world. DeFi and DAPP are completely wrong it. And now NFT and Macverse are also headed that way. But Ethereum gets more expensive every day. Right now it's over $3,000. The experts say that when you evaluate an ETH miner, you have to look at two things. The first, power consumption. The second, how long does it take to earn back your investment? According to the factory, the ETH miner YM100 uses 2.4 kilowatts per hour and has a daily revenue of $100 which means that daily profit is around 75%. It has 3,300 watt power supply, four powerful cooling fans. It also has one control board and three hushing boards, each of which has 16 ASIC chips. The whole unit is 16 kg. It's 37 cm tall, 25 cm wide, and 53 cm long. The YM100 is the world's largest and most powerful saving Ethereum miner. Its hash rate is equivalent to 10588 graphics cars miner, but its power consumption is just a one sixth graphics cars miner. So now I have a daily revenue of $100, just $4 for electricity. Obviously, ETH power is very valuable and it comes with cost. A bonus is that it takes up just one tenth the space of graphics card miner, and the ASIC doesn't require daily maintenance like a graphics card miner. If you are interested in buying it, you can search YM100 at apexcomining.com. And if you have any questions on setting up for mining, please feel free to contact us. Okay, then let's introduce how to get it started. First, we need to prepare a computer and a network cable, so we can connect them to the same network. Once the cables are connected, just plug it in and start it up. Now we found this IP address in the router network. We can say the displayed IP address, copy it, let's access the miner. Open the browser, enter the IP address, and just configure the mining pool and workers. Then we just wait for the hashing power to rise.